Good morning, Jaja children, and greetings in the name of Jehovah, our Creator, and Jesus Christ of Nazareth, the King who rules the world. We're looking at genetically modified foods today, because a lot of times when you buy these things, you really don't know. So this used to be tangerine, and they used to have seeds. Now when you buy them, there's no seed. See, no seed. When you press it, you're supposed to feel seeds. Same thing with the orange. A lot of these things come out of California too and the United States all over. Used to be, when you buy them, you get seeds in them. So when you see you buy them and the watermelon and it has no seeds, go get me the watermelon in the fridge with the seed. That's genetically modified, okay? So you gotta be very careful now with your foods. And look out for things with seeds as opposed to the ones without seeds and then mark the brands or where you got it that had the seeds in it most supermarkets you're not gonna find things with seeds and it's creeping into the farmers market now so when you buy your watermelon it's supposed to look like that it's supposed to have the seeds in it okay when you buy your orange it's supposed to have the seeds in it these lemons I started using because I found them at Sam's with seed but other places they have no seeds so you see the seeds still in there this is the cherry with the seed and this is the grape with the seed that's the one I buy so also these are organic um, berries that's good for your daily health as well so that's um what's that raspberry this one is blackberries so add these to your diet every day the organic version because you got to eat the skin and you can wash them nicely with some um, baking soda so that you clean off the clean off the pesticides I don't think they use pesticides in these but whatever remains from the dirt so these are strawberries so add that so this is just Noticing little by little more foods and more foods are becoming genetically modified So you have to be on the lookout and push back against those things and start planting your own start sourcing Like these ones they're called red globe grapes the ones with the seeds and these are the cherries with the seeds so Our world is changing little by little a lot a lot but some people still grow them with the seeds so try as best as possible to look for things with seeds and buy and eat those for you and your children and with that i say shalom have a blessed day